Welcome to Fly Over the Map. Today, we find ourselves in Poland. Thank you so much for watching each video. If you have any suggestions, feedback, or ideas, please don't hesitate to let me know in the comments. The today's landmark we find in Warsaw. We are flying over the royal castle today. Let's enjoy the view. The Royal Castle in Warsaw, also known as Zamek Kraluski, stands as a symbol of Poland's rich history and cultural heritage. Located in the heart of Warsaw, this historic palace has played a central role in the nation's political and cultural life for centuries. Its origins can be traced back to the late 13th century when it was first established as a wooden fortification by the Dukes of Mazovia. Over time, it evolved into a grand Gothic brick castle under King Casimir III the Great in the 14th century. The castle's strategic position on the Vistula River made it a key administrative and military hub. Its most significant transformation came in the late 16th century under King Sigismund III Vesa, who expanded it extensively, giving it the mannerist and Baroque elements that characterize it today. The royal castle then became the official residence of Polish monarchs and the seat of the Polish parliament, embedding itself deeply in the political life of the Polish-Lithuanian Commonwealth. Architecturally, the royal castle is a stunning example of various styles that reflect its long history. The complex includes the main building with a distinctive five-sided courtyard and several annexes, such as the Kubicki Arcades and the Royal Library. The castle's exterior features a grand facade and elegant towers, while its interior is renowned for its opulent rooms, halls, and galleries. The Great Assembly Hall, also known as the Throne Room, is one of the castle's most magnificent spaces, adorned with gilded stucco, elaborate chandeliers, and intricate ceiling paintings. Another significant room is the Marble Room, which houses statues of Polish monarchs and decorative marble columns. The castle chapel, with its Baroque altarpiece and ornate decorations, highlights the castle's deep religious and cultural roots. Throughout its history, the royal castle has faced numerous challenges, including destruction and reconstruction. It was significantly damaged during the Swedish invasion in the 17th century, but was subsequently rebuilt. The most devastating destruction occurred during World War II when the castle was almost entirely demolished by the Nazis after the Warsaw Uprising in 1944. Following the war, the ruins stood as a symbol of the country's suffering. In the 1970s, a massive reconstruction effort was initiated, funded largely by donations from the Polish people and the international community. This meticulous restoration was based on historical documents, photographs, and surviving architectural fragments, and the castle was officially reopened in 1984, fully restored to its former glory. We look forward to welcoming you on board again next time for Fly Over the Map. If you enjoyed the video, please leave us a like or comment. 